chatting with Villanova's Phil Booth after the Wildcats took care of Gonzaga here at MSG. Phil, what did it take tonight to beat a really good Gonzaga team? Uh, they're a really tough team to uh, prepare for. They got a lot of good shooters, uh, really move the ball, play them selfish, and great defensively. So um, it was a tough game to game plan for. You got to be, uh, you got to really be locked into the game plan and um, just know how great of a team they are, how much they can uh, can score, and how easy they can score. Individually tonight, you tie a career high. How does it feel to be back playing basketball and at a high level? Uh, it feels great to, to be back out here playing. I mean, you missed the competition after not being not being able to play for a year, so it was great to be back out there. And um, we just came out, played well, and uh, put well enough to get the win. That's all that really matters. In that first half, you took an extended period at the point guard position because of Jalen Brunson's foul trouble. How did it feel to be running the point? And that's really when you guys started to separate yourselves in this game. Uh, you know, I've run the port, uh, point guard a lot of times, uh, sometimes throughout the games, uh, other times in my, throughout my career. So it wasn't uh, that much different. Um, we got a lot of stops. So we were playing a lot of bigger lineup. We had, we had Mikel at the two and E at the three and uh, Omari at the four and uh, Dada Crosby Roundtree at the five. So that was a, a great defensive team. I think that was more important. We had the bigger lineup when they were able to get more stops. I think that got us a lot of get more shots up and get more points. What's it like playing in front of this garden crowd when you guys get rolling? <laughs> I mean, it feels like a home game sometimes, most of the time in here. It gets pretty loud. You know, we love how the garden is, uh, the lights are all on the court. It's just, it's a great place to play. I mean, I'm pretty sure nobody has a problem playing here. So it's good that we got things going and got to win it here. A career best performance for Mikhail Bridges, Villanova taking care of business against Gonzaga. And Mikhail, what made you so locked in tonight on a big stage? My teammates and coaches, you know, told me I need to play with the fire I did in Atlantis. And, I knew what I had to do, how I was laser focused, you know, take everything serious right when we got here today. So just doing all that and my team is having my back for everything, knowing that if I mess up, they're going to have my back. So just having confidence in myself and my teammates, having confidence in me. Well, anybody that watched that performance against Gonzaga knows that Bridges brought the fire back with them from the Bahamas. What would you say is the biggest growth in your game over the last five months, six months? Playing aggressive, you know, that's the main thing for me. And I, past years I've been here, I wasn't as aggressive. I just played with the flow. And now just trying to play smart while being aggressive. And just keep doing that and just keep working on everything else I'm doing. When you make a play like that dunk in the second half, do you feel that your game has just hit a completely new level? Uh, I can feel myself being more aggressive, yeah. And, you know, it's – it's a good thing for us, and you know my team is having my back after that, and came down, and got stopped on the other end. It's not only the points this man scores and the defense he provides for the Villanova Wildcat, but Coach Wright talks about your leadership. What specifically are you doing to make sure the entire team brings that fire and aggression that you bring on the court? Just trying to lead them by doing all the little things. You know, let the young guys watch us, watch me, do all the little things, and they know when they come in. Okay, if our captain and our leader doing that then I'm going to do the same thing. And once you start doing that, the game comes to you and you just, you know how much you work on your game and, you know, stuff like this happens. 